Welcome back to Sakura Wars! We're resuming. Last time we got ditched by our teammates because we suck. No, oh, well. This is as long as we're aware. Mr. Sunnyside. We're gonna talk to our boss and say, hey, maybe we shouldn't be in this hellhole called New York. It is a hellhole. Well, yeah. Hello, sir. Are you here training under your sensei? This is my Chinese sensei to help me become more of a Japanese person. Oh, actually. Uh, oh my god, this guy looks like one of the psychopaths in Dead Rising 3. <laughs> oh, I love it. Must be his grandfather. <laughs> yeah, years later, zombies happen. So, I'm here to retire. No. Commander, I... Um... Mm. What's with this stupid garden? Yeah, we're doing it. What's with this garden? It angers me! Why do you have a Buddha statue in a Tori? Yes. <laughs> yes! That is exactly what I came here to talk about. You have about. terrible feng shui! And you should know this having a Chinese master. It's an authentic Japanese garden. Just you imported that statue? Why? You stole it! Um... <laughs> oh, I'm getting kicked out of the country. Yeah, we're getting deported. We haven't done anything bad yet. <laughs> Woo! What? What? Oh. <laughs> so we'll keep people doing uh, menial tasks as an usher while I set up your paperwork to get you out of the fucking country and out of the game. So wait a minute. The only reason I'm still here is because of the bureaucracy? Pretty much, yeah. Pushing papers, just trying to get me out. You don't like being here. They don't like you being here. You're fucking dead weight. And, you know, I, I think we need to throw this little guppy back and uh, cast our line again, see if we can get a real barracuda. Know what I'm saying? All right. At least they know what per what type of people play this. It's a very short game. See, that's why. I <laughs> oh, so that's why we're doing it. It's a three episode series. Yes. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I should really get back to the theater. Maybe I'll hang myself in the supply closet. <laughs> I'll pull a Phantom of the Opera. I'll just fall for the rafters. I kind of figured we were going to meet another girl. Long have I watched fear and pain gather before me only to send them away on the wind. That was crass, I'm sorry. You're the poet type, aren't you? My heart soars with the birds in the sky. Because I've been picked apart by vultures, and one of them has my heart. Clutched in its claws. Look at that, 1920s wheelchair. Good God. Faking it. I'm kidding, don't tear me apart. Nah, tear me apart, it's fun. Alright, fine, tear me apart. Then he'll be in a wheelchair, and it'll be really ironic. <laughs> no, I already made one weakness. It's ironic with my weakness! You look down at the birds, there's scraps of cloth just all around them. Like, what did you feed them? Ah, oh, Jiminy Sunrise. No longer have to worry about her. Or the... the yammering children that are around here every morning. What the fuck? No wonder people say you just stay out of Central Park. Children scare the birds away. Now, the birds scare the children away. I want that written now. <laughs> Make that a character. Put it in there. So yeah, I want it. This is Diana Caprice. She is. Let me pull up the art book slash. Oh yeah. Manual. She what's, what's is. What's Blondie have to say? She is Diana Caprice, 19 years old, born January 12, 1909. She is 5'4", weighs 99 pounds, and is blood type AB. I know. Uh, you, you better tell him something. Fine. I'm worried about my future. Please, be my psychiatrist, because apparently I can't afford one. Well, here's some cyanide and a rope, so, uh, no need to Jesus, worry anymore. Jesus, why does everybody want to kill my- want me to kill myself, including me? Don't get to might be stuck doing those chores for now, but eventually they'll be licking your boots! I was about to say, eventually they'll see your worth and then not use you. <laughs> about that time, they'll send you back. Of course, if you don't have any worth, then... Okay. <laughs> there, perfect. Now hold. Hold. Excellent. 
The world's already becoming a nicer place already! And she steps on a rabbit. Fuck, <laughs> girl! <laughs> so, okay, so she's out. <laughs> Already turned her into a psycho killer. God damn it. <laughs> Normally it takes at least a week for me to think of anime girls like that. I like her theme song, though. Is it playing right now? <laughs> yes. See, uh, each of these girls has their own theme song that plays whenever you, like, have a scene with them. <laughs> and they have their own voiced version of the song as well, as sung by the voice actresses. Hmm. Which is another big reason we're playing the Japanese version. Okay. Mwah! Again, little lip. That's, that's quite a large lip. I mean, unless they're thinking of the other pair of lips. I want to think that they're not that clever, but then again, maybe they are. I'm I, if they actually did think of that, I fucking quit. <laughs> what? Oh. Well, I mean, I'm still waiting on the bureaucrats to get through with their paperwork, and then I'll be shipped back. Then they cover you in pig's blood. Th what is with these girls? No matter how bad you want to be here, you're about as useful as a toilet. Toilets are very useful! They're extremely useful. They're the most useful thing! Of course I realize that, you stupid b- I just want to help! Yeah, I just want to help. Even a toilet can't be useful! Oh my god, please, you called it. Please piss at me, Miss Weinberg! No! <laughs> that was actually- Yeah, that was actually a very good thing to do. Because there's also an option for not saying anything, and you just kind of go- Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, there's the secret fourth option to every conversation. It's usually never good. Well, right. Ah! Back. Voiced by Antonio Banderas. No wonder you like the, <laughs> the sub better. No. Wow, what a cunt! <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ! Ratchety old bitch! I, I will kill myself after this! Nobody wants me! Nobody ever wanted me! You know, a toilet can be useful, but it has to flush first, you know. I don't get your metaphor. It means no matter what, you have to be swallowing all of our shit! Yeah. Stop calling me shiny. Hey, they promoted me! I'm already a system manager! <laughs> I just figured I've got upgraded to toilet scrubber. No! <laughs> See, this is before uh, there was any sort of uh, equality in the workforce. Oh, that's true. Except this is anime land where all the women have all the job opportunities. <laughs> <laughs> they get the shitty jobs, too. He'll be janitor until he's 45, but G Gemini, she's going to be CEO by the uh, end of the week at this rate. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, a progressive New York! <laughs> in the past only? Only in anime, right? Bullshit! Only in anime! <laughs> Nothing like that would ever happen. <laughs> no, that's Little Tongue Theater. <laughs> yeah, that's in the Red Light District. <laughs> you look all around late night New York and you see all the lights are red. They're all red! Ah! Oh, I'm under a stop sign. No. Yeah. No. Oh. Okay. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm fucking stupid. And then you hear a wheelchair wheeling in the background in a dark alley. Squeaky. 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 Tweet, tweet. Oh, anyway, free time. Go. Okay. Uh, oh, we can't do this thing properly. It's right here. It's what I live for in games. All right. Uh... You don't need to go down there. Yeah, I'm curious. I think the matter time is for it. I was like, we should check it out while I'm here cleaning. Mm -hmm. Ooh, mm -hmm. there are a few doors here. I wonder which one leads to which room. Okay. Uh, Get the fuck out! Hi. Why? Perhaps we should go. Uh, okay. Duh. Get out. You're, you're dressed like a Chinese person, but you speak Russian? Duh. <laughs> See. And you speak- oh, okay. Oh, you're multilingual. Right to the hot spring, I knew you'd be here. Well, I mean, it's something to look at. Well, the rooftop is just hanging by a thread. That's a safety hatch, so let's fix it. Oh, hi. Yes. 
Well, I'm just thinking, you know, as a toilet, I need to fix the bath. Because <laughs> that's what toilets do. Just put bleach around my lips. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah? Well, I'll have you know that I'm actually a dweeby little stick. <laughs> Fuck it. Oh, God, you're terrible. <laughs> may have been the wrong thing to say. No shit. <laughs> Woo! Uh, Why not? It's New York. But you said... <laughs> you were advertising, so I figured I'd look at it. You were asking for it. <laughs> God, we are naive and stupid. Because you're making him naive and stupid. Hey, I know. <laughs> it's almost like I'm doing this on purpose. I sabotage! Think, I sabotage. hope you are. Well, well, sabotage nothing. I've already played it twice. Yeah. Alright, right back in. I did the canonical ending, and then I did the one that I wanted. I'm glad we had a transition for that. Let's see, what else we got? Rooftop guard shield at me. <laughs> So, Hi, Subaru, what are you doing here? Oh, hello, Honda. <laughs> Mitsubishi-san? Is that you? Ah, oh, Monsieur Toyota. Welcome. That's Rush. Oh, she, she reads like 15 different uh, languages about no dramas. I would have laughed my ass off if she said, That's Japanese. Uh, oh. Oops. Those are numbers. It's in binary. And yes, I also read Braille. Why? Because. <laughs> Clean up all of her book mess. Yeesh. God, she left words all over the place! Why? Chad, it's in your room. Here to be the toilet again. Perhaps next time I should just strip. Maybe that'll help my battle tactic. You were gonna show me all your sides, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Uh. What's going on with your wrist? She's wearing a very formal, conservative blue suit. It may not be gorgeous, but it exudes an elegant aura. Calibre! How about, uh, your earrings? Her hair is really oh, well. blonde and shiny. Hmm. Call, call Maybe her she'll shiny. feel better if I stroke her what hair. What the fuck? I stroke her hair, wait. Jesus. What's wrong with you? God, this uh, kid's weird. Okay, hair, okay. What? You, you did something, didn't you? No, I just looked at her suit again. Okay. Looks good on you. Tailor fit. You look gorgeous, honey. That way there's no cleavage for all you dirty little perverts at home. Thank Christ. Alright, so what were you saying about the pet? I was saying the hair. Yeah? What about it? The hair thing again. Why? Yeah, really. I'm gonna go against that. So you go right for the tits. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> no! I mustn't stare at women that way, especially when they're my boss! Yeah, good, good advice, actually. What does that mean? That means you're gonna be staring at her amorously. You are a fool. Damn it, I knew I should look at her like this, but I can't help me! <laughs> <laughs> I'm staring at your blue suit. I wasn't staring at any- <laughs> YOU FOOL! <laughs> you fucking fool! <laughs> Shin, I appreciate the compliment, but kindly fuck off. I'm gonna leave this place in a body bag! <laughs> I really hope I do! <laughs> Alright, head pats time. He'll be okay, Ratchet. Nope! I'm over here now. I was just trying to pat you on the head like the little bitch you are. Oh, cut it out, I'm not kidding. You, you are... told me to do that? Why? Might have been hair, not head. Oh. Well, then I should be going now. I have a report to file against one of my employees oops. and how inappropriately he's touching me. Well, oops. Are, are you all done in here? Yes. Next girl. Yeah, the only thing I have left to clean is my criminal record now. Time to clean up my act. Yeah, at least she gave you pity points, though. <laughs> like, I think you have to try hard to shake her off. I like a girl that's easy. 
well, that's a few more hell points for me. Yeah. <laughs> Straight there after this. How many hundreds do you have? I'm already at 1,600 <laughs> myself. <laughs> I'm pretty high up there, gotta say. Okay, so what? first, uh, I... What is this? We are going to sweep the floor with the broom. Okay. Yeah, tell me how to clean. Sweep the floor with the broom. That's what. Mm-hmm. All done. Now it's... Wax the floor. Okay. Let's screw waxer. Oh, we gotta wipe the floor before we wax it. Okay, that makes sense. I thought figure we would wipe it so that the wax would get into the... Oh, so shiny. Oh, uh, final test. We're just gonna put away the bucket. Wog. Bucket. Oh no! She is all wet. Oh, you're running out of time, dude. Wipe the floor! 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 <laughs> what the fuck? You gotta go put your work above the wall. <laughs> Why? Because she probably thinks, hey, where the hell are you touching? Besides, she can handle herself. She was in Texas being a samurai and all that shit. Okay. What if I wanted her to kick me in the nuts? <laughs> well, just d do your job properly, at least. I was you, you, trying. You can, you can treat the women however like shit you want, but don't let it affect your duties. <laughs> What if she is my job? I'm working on this girl. Hand jobs don't count. Oh. By the way, I figured out it's rated T, so that probably won't happen. Yeah, nothing will happen. So, 7 o'clock, we're going to meet her in the green room, which I think is the left side of the backstage, so you've got a few minutes until then. I think you can check out like a few things outside, like okay. your gift shop and the bar sure. and... Let's try, let's try to make up for uh, for bad first impressions. What do you want, you terrible person? Hi! I'm just here to be terrible. Oh, yeah! We started carrying photos of the Star Division members. You know, the one that you're totally not. Okay. Yeah, that's pretty great. Let's talk. Buy photographs. Oh, sorry. Let's buy. Can I get some photos? Do you really want it? Okay. Cool. That'll be $7,000. Oh, cool. Uh... Which one do you like? Well, uh, just because I like Subaru, I'd go with Subaru. Okay. So you go with Ratchet. Uh, that's photo of Sajita. Hmm. Uh... Let's be middle of the road. Yep. I think Ratchet is pretty middle of the road for a waifu. Mm-hmm. You've got no personality besides being a bitchy boss. Of course, I made you that way. That's why you're out of the game for most of it. I have crafted you that way. You know, you want to talk to me? You! But you are Japanese, a little girl! That's bad. In Seattle. Have you ever seen, uh... Like, there's this old Kool-Aid commercial... Where, like from the 60s, when cultural sensitivities weren't quite what they were. So it's like, you know, little Japanese boys and girls love the Kool Aid! Yeah, they, they got the squinty guys are dressed in the, you know, all that. Oh. The Kotats, yeah, it's just, yeah. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, that was fun. Well, I'm so glad talking to an eight-year-old is uh, giving me such... How old is she, anyway? I don't think it's sad. Old enough. Oh, thanks. It's a little uh, fourth wall breaking moment here. Press the square button. Oh, it is neat that all the costumes that they had designed by her. Oh, that is nice. That's pretty cool. Hi, uh, Periwinkle, whatever your so name is. So this is Plum Spaniel, who in the English version is called Cherry Cocker. Pardon me? Yeah, Plum Spaniel it is. Cherry Cocker. Awesome. 
you know, Cocker Spaniel. I don't know where the cherry and the plum thing came from. I mean... Let me lick your fingers. Jesus Dunk Christ! Dunk your hands on my eyes! Oh. I gotcha! Okay. Run out your feelings! <laughs> <laughs> Tell me how you feel with your burning hand! I know the best way to solve third degree burns, and that's a wedding ring! <laughs> I don't really need your help anymore, so I guess you, you can go back to Japan. You didn't need my help in the first place. You can go back to Japan without any problems now. It's your without fault any that regrets. You burnt your hand. Jesus. All right. It's about ten till seven. It looks like. All right. I'll just head there. This will be the place where I hang myself. I promise, Jimmy. I made it with her in the green room. There's still time before seven o'clock, but. What should I do until then? Go right to the green room. It's still early, but I think I'll go to the Gemini now. See, in in a visual novel, this would be the place where we walk in and somebody's murdered. We'll Just figure it out. It's not this kind of thing. But it would be such an awesome twist! You know it would be! It'd be a Game of Thrones twist where it's like, oh, let's just kill someone to get some fake drama instilled here. But then it becomes a murder mystery while you're trying to, you know, make love to toilets. <laughs> well, let's finish up quick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's really weird. I'll go check the circuit breaker. The lights are off in the theater. We don't know why. Let's find out why. All right. A murder happens. Play too much Phoenix Wright. There is gonna be a murder. The murder of your career! Hmm. You got it. I'm just following your ass. I mean... I guess you're following mine. Wait, where's the rooftop? That's in the basement, right? I think it's in the basement. I'll go upstairs and check. <laughs> Push all the buttons! Throw the chair at it! I like how even though this game was made in 2005, and they're using Steam pewters, as they're called, I like how they do look like old 1980s computers, you know, from the 70s as well. Mm -hmm. The cathode ray tubes, you, the, the you, fuzziness, the analog signal, the fact that there's steam everywhere! What in the fuck did you do, you dunderhead? Gah! Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. I'm gonna get blamed for this. Not good, not good. <laughs> I'm gonna get blamed for this. Uh, you probably are. What'd you say I couldn't see you? Is that Miss Ratchet? Yes, that's. Uh, I, I, be I better I, hold I out my so. hands and try to feel around for Miss Ratchet. Her hair works like a flashlight. <laughs> <laughs> and Saji does works like a blacklight. Ew. Uh, maybe that's not right. Uh, Firing her is the answer! Uh, just deal with the problem, will ya? Uh, oops. Now you're just gonna just stay silent because... Oh. <laughs> How do you see me? The lights are out. <laughs> but Subaru liked that, I think. Just act like a Japanese person and then Subaru will like you. Easy there, killer. But hey! And I still got points! And, you, and they still liked it because Subaru talked some sense into her. <sighs> I, I wouldn't use Steam. Steam's a bit broken right Five now. Five Nights at Little Lip, anyone? <gasps> oh my god. They start getting killed by, like, Steam robots. <laughs> well, that's a little later, actually. We're shoved into costumes. But who's gonna fix the electricity? Well, I guess, I guess we're being fixed with turning the lights back on. Maybe we could finally get in good with everybody and uh, make it up for being a disappointment and a failure and a lecher and a pervert. So now we just bring flashlights onto the stage. We could just summon light magic. No, oh, thanks for using your brain, you frigid bitch. <laughs> or bastard. Some loud ass cicadas. Shut out there. up, bug! <laughs> Trying to woo some waifus! 
Menial task is the way to any woman's heart, right? That's right. Now grip it hard. Got it. Put the two levers in front of you and hold them firmly. This, mm -hmm. is, this is important. You, you need to pay attention to this, actually. Okay. So here we go. Three, two, one. Down. Oh, uh... You do better, though. I could do better. Hey, there you go. Sorry, I started using the D-pad out of you know, wanting to use the D-pad. Okay. Bam. More points for Subaru. Cool. Ratchet and Sajito really don't like you right now. I don't think. That's ah, fine. I didn't like them either. <laughs> Thanks, Super. I really don't know what to say. I, I really don't know what to... You know what? How about we just keep it at that? Let's not talk to Subaru anymore. Wrong! You have to talk to her! <laughs> ah! I, I actually kind of remember a theater I went to where in order to let people know that the show was starting, they'd like, blow an air horn. Or a so, foghorn. Okay, so go, go, do it. Other way! Keep going! Come on. What are you doing? Good. Well done. Jeez. <laughs> what did I do anyway? I haven't been paying attention. Sorry. You're fixing the electricity. You, oh. you, you turn the circuits back on, now you get electricity back into the stage. Alright, let's see. Place the damage circuits and pipes with new ones and place the panel. Okay. Uh, there we go. Alright. Man, visual novels are so hard. This is actually one of the more involved visual novels I've ever played, really. Wow, you changed the circuit board! No way, you changed it, Senpai! It's just so doki doki! Don't call me Senpai. We're the same age, Godzilla. No, we're not. How oh. old is she? I think you're like 18 or 19. She's like 16. Oh. Oh, that's fine. Don't call me Senpai when you could be calling me Daddy. Gotta <laughs> 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 oh! oh. hate playing these. The stage light just went out. <laughs> we gotta fix it. All right, let's fix it. Oh, poop! I forgot to flip the circuit breaker when we were playing in the theater. Fuck. God damn it! <laughs> Alright, run it! Yeah, let's go! Vault! <laughs> run! Fix it for the, uh, the show must go on! Let's go! <laughs> go! Run, goddammit, run! I'm running! What Keep the, running! What is happening? You're All running right. down so you can fix the circuit breaker so you can go fix the electricity so you can get the state of the back no, up. No, I know, I mean, what's happening with your controller? It's a shitty PS2 controller from, like, 2006! <laughs> even then it was used, it was probably even earlier! Cancel the series! This ah, is too no. hard! <laughs> Reading stuff is hard! <laughs> flip the breaker, flip the breaker, go! Flip the breaker! Did I flip it? Um, let's see. What did I do wrong? Were you supposed to press the button? No, I don't think so. Well... BAM! Alright, show must go on. Cool. Ah. Uh, uh, did it. We saved the show. It was all thanks to shitty wiring. Really, you shouldn't be rewarded for doing your yeah, job. Yeah, and you shouldn't be rewarded for any of this. Oh, please go back to the open mouth one. Just like, go table! <laughs> <laughs> we did it. We made friends, we made enemies, and the show just went on. And the, the theater got shut again. down. Ah, well, that was fun while it lasted. Being deported because I destroyed a theater. <laughs> Next chapter will be taking place in Ethiopia. 
and then the third chapter takes place in Brazil. You're getting kicked out all over the world. Nobody wants to keep me. Sounds good. We can take uh, one trope away. No high school. We're walking home because we're neighbors, not because we go to school together. You look so graceful as I tripped over my feet. <laughs> 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 I was going to say it was your fault to begin with. I was thinking about it. <laughs> uh, see, she's digging into your heart. She's pulling on your heartstrings just a little bit. I'm just gonna take my pointer finger and just point it on your forehead and then just push you back just a little bit. <laughs> just gonna go ahead and take my my, my palm here and, and just, just just a little bit there. Oh my gosh, she's got brain damage! What'd you do to her? What? Just you know, personal spaces. Yeah. Oh sure. Oh, you mean your apartment? Uh, sure. For a literal second. Hey, just, help! Oh wow! Damn, she's got guns mounted on the wall. A uh, cow hanging by a noose there in the background. My leaks doesn't let me do any of this shit. Who's your landlord? Apparently, the best landlord. So the first time I've ever been in a girl's room, I'm a little, I'm a little nervous. Oh, God, so this is a guy. girl's room, huh? Let's see. Uh, got some tomatoes over here. Those are apples. Apples over here, yes. A barrel full of apples. She probably feeds them to the horse that's in her room. Good thing that's not a secret. Let's see. A mason jar full of left eyes. <laughs> No, wait, she's not the serial killer. She's just happy-go-lucky. Actually. I gotta get out of here. That's horse poop. Grandma's ashes, no! It's Miso! Oh. She is literally a Texas samurai. Um. Show me how to pickle, protagonist. Show me your pickle. No, show me how to pickle. Well, first you just got teach me how to pickle. Teach me how to teach me how to teach me how to pickle. Hey, easy on the pickling on my analog stick. I pickled there. it. How's <laughs> that? <laughs> Absolutely amazing. You're really awesome the way you turn that analog stick, senpai. That's right. That's how I beat my enemies with pickles. Yeah, whenever I defeat my enemies, I kidnap them and I stick them in a barrel full of water for three weeks until they turn into prunes. Okay. They call me the miso killer. <laughs> oh, it's my roommate, my horse. <laughs> I don't think I'm wrong in that. You're not wrong. Now it turns out... Gemini is actually a horse! You know, I haven't seen a lot of centaurs in games lately. All I can really think about is just... Uh, Shining Force. That's it. I'm actually thinking she takes her pants off and all, and the horse half comes out. She hides it well. Yeah. Oh, yeah, too. How do you fit into those? Gemini! No, oh, wait. Hey, look, it's her neighbor. That's Larry. Her trusty steed. And neighbor. <laughs> not, not neighbor, roommate. He lives here too. The fuck you call me? Larry? <laughs> Nay. Nay. <laughs> Nay. 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 Nani? Nay. 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 Wow, you actually like that. Pleasure to meet you, Larry. I'm sure we'll be the best of friends. Nay! The best of people. Can I romance the horse? I've tried, but I don't think so. I think you can in the Japanese version. You've actually tried. No, I haven't tried! 
But now I think I might. <laughs> it's got more personality Woo! than Ratchet. <laughs> yes. What did you get for groping in on girls and shit? Apparently. Well, fine. If you want a little bit of love and Larry, I can do that too. Alright, now this is turning into a weird anime. Normal brother or sister. My brother's a horse! Not Sword Art Online, whatever they're trying to do now. You always go to Sword Art Online, but there are, are way worse. Because all I can think of is the fact that she's trying to he's trying to confess to his little sister about some kind of bullshit or whatever. I don't know. No, no. This is even Sword Art, Sword Art Online I'm thinking of. I'm sorry, Sword Art Online is just easy to hate, okay? It's very easy to hate. Oh, it's not that bad. I know I'm gonna get a lot of people saying it is, but it's not that bad. I haven't seen it before, so it's bad as hell. I have only heard about things on the internet, and the internet is truth. But honestly, though, what I, like, the clips I have seen of Sword Art Online, I would go, yeah, I would absolutely hate this. I will say, season two, they, uh, they actually kick Kirito's ass, which is what he needed. He's not OP anymore. Well, good. I thought that was the cat for a minute. It's like, what is going on with cat What's Emergency! Emergency! Hide your horses! They're coming for them! Oh, great. Big ol' fucking robots attacking the Statue of Liberty. No, uh -oh. No, we need to take out those steampunks, right? <laughs> I, I use good old game myself. Get in, losers! We're going to Little Lip Theater! <laughs> You're not wrong. You made it! I get to come along! Yeah, we need a toilet. Wait, no. No. No, no. Abort. Abort. So we get to go, but not Jiminy. Wait, why not? Because we are the lieutenant of the, of the combat review. And she's still just a simple janitor. Lady. Oh, I thought they needed a target. <laughs> or, you know, bait. Well, okay, here's the real reason. Ratchet can't do it. Why not? Because she sucks. She really sucks. She sucks a lot. So we gotta pick up the slack. <laughs> oh, Sebasa, I will die for you! I've got the rank two in her social link. She'll die for me. Yeah, glad to hear it. Okay, all right. Time to repair some bonds with a little bit of a uh, little bit of thread and a needle. Prepare to be amazed. All right, so now we're gonna finally get into the crew some gameplay, actual, honest to god combat gameplay. Holy shit! I didn't think it happened. The first anime cutscene to show you how super surce we are. All right. Let's get into our Voltron robots, we'll turn into a giant pair of lips. Oh yeah, I fucking love Voltron too, that's why I like this game too. The, what the fuck? Ba, 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 ba. Lip 1, activate! This is where everybody undresses and changes into their Voltron suits, so, you know, it's still pretty analog. Alright ladies, let's... So... What? So that's kinda cool. Ah! Oh. This is the conference room. So we're gonna learn what's going on. We're gonna take out a bad guy. Alright, Eggs Benedict. Why is the kid here? What's your beef? No. Egg. He's like, he's like combat stupid. <laughs> but for that, you do need my beef. Let's squash the beef and add chicken, because you're a coward! <laughs> God damn, that was really good. <laughs> Thank you. But Ratchet, he is nothing but Greenhorn. I don't need greens. If he is a Greenhorn, it is a very bright Viridian at best. Or Chartreuse, even. Okay, I really hate myself. Because when Subaru said harm, I thought she said harem. This is a good game, alright? It's it's not garbage. You're only garbage if you play garbage, so hey. But no, we, no, there's somebody attacking New York. We're the only people who can save him, so we're gonna save New York. 
Mm -hmm. New York will be saved. It will. It will be saved. Okay. Main monitor turn on. Okay, turn the main monitor. I just gotta get in this bike and just <laughs> crank, 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 crank. It's a Fujiyama star. <laughs> oh, this, this is an anachronism. <laughs> yeah, it means a uh, full ultimate justice in yonder awful maker. Attribute star. What? It don't have to make sense, but thanks. <laughs> it's all one big acronym. Oh, yeah. I love it. Acronym is even an acronym. It's for arbitrarily concise. <laughs> the last letter turns into another acronym. An acronym within an acronym. Mr. Wong, I get it. That's Ada oh, Wong's father. Oh, makes perfect sense. Well, he's white, she's Wong. That's right. White? Wrong? Left? Look at where the Wu Tan is! Watch him go! Any questions before we set off? Does anybody need their water wings? Yes. Uh, I already know about stars. They got bombed. Uh, stars are actually the things we're going to be piloting. Oh. What can you tell me about the mission? So let's go to the Liberty Island, where the Statue of Liberty is. That's where the bad things are. We're going to destroy those bad things. We're going to win. We're going to be awesome. We're going to be cool. And people are going to respect us. Mm-hmm. Okay. Don't ask me about anything. We're good. You got me. I'll tell you about everything. Like how Michael with Sunnyside is actually a crossdresser. Okay. Well, not really, but, you know. My sweet and sour duo. Ah! Which one's sweet, which one's sour? I like how they're both wearing... Looks the... like I'll have to try them both. <laughs> I'm done. You can have this. God, I'm terrible. I was just noticing how they're wearing the pansexual flag. I think that's what that is. <clears throat> Alright, I'm playing now, so... Alright, thanks. All right, thanks. Oh, look at that! I got points, and I got more points. They like me. They really like me. Cool. So now is the time. Now is the time. Where did my filter go? Your filter is right, like right here. It's on your microphone. Personal filter. Oh, Jesus Christ! This game doing to me. Look, I teach it you to feel. <laughs> feel what? I don't anyway, know. Here, take this. Take this back. Disgust. We're about to get to the game part of the game. Disgust to myself. Uh, anyway, anyway what, I mean, what do you think is gonna happen? We're gonna do Uta Waterdo Mono in 2025. <laughs> See, See you guys later. later. <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's why you brought me along. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> you sure you made the right decision here? I don't know. <laughs> he told me he's the master at being bait. Let him do it. He's the master of bait. Oh, I see what. Ah. Okay. It's like someone who jacks off a lot. Yeah. We're, yes. we're such a jerk. Off to our own adventure. I use this hand to jack off with. Look at him, whenever he's in the mech suit, all of a sudden, he's just like a completely different person. He's so dreamy. I hate to be that guy's job. Yep, it still looks like a mech. So this is your mech suit. Cool. Turns into a jet. Yeah, it does turn into a jet. Cool. Because it's awesome. It's 1928 stuff and... You keep saying 1928, but you can't convince me. Uh, okay, I lied. It's 1929. At least the anime takes place in 1929, I'm pretty sure. This game ends in for Christmas 1928, I think. Hmm. So that's Sajita's star. She's got some sort of chain whip or whatever. This is Subaru's. I think she's just got a bunch of guns. Or No, she's got a sword, right? She's got a sword. She's got... She has a fan. That's right, a fan. 
not a sword because fans are somehow good weapons in ancient samurai Japanese warfare. Mm -hmm. And Ratchet just sucks. She's got fists. Oh, um, oh! Throwing knives. Useless kunais that can be deflected easily off of someone's armor. And you've got four swords! Cause I'm number- oh. I was about to say I was the highest rank there, but I'm not. So alright, everyone is all in these, ready to go, and we're about to finally get into a battle for the first time. Where all the relationships and all the stuff you've been doing in gameplay finally start to come together. Okay. Once we make our way. So the Statue of Liberty has already been destroyed. Oh, please let me fire out the lips like a big hawk to Loogie. Patui. Very, very subtle, very secret operation that goes on around here. No one knows about it. Absolutely nobody. And that guy who's still on the street going, WHAT THE fuck? <laughs> OH MY GOD! See, it's 1928 because no one has their cell phone out taking a... That's a freaking crossbow. We're getting hot! We are gonna get slung out like a slingshot. It's soul time! Let's see, use that in the trailer. Yeah. Got it. Go! Oh! <laughs> well, the lips actually did go into an off sound, so, you know, it, it doesn't make sense. Anyway, now we're airborne! So guess what? See you next time on Let's Play Sakura Wars 5! <laughs> Woo!